Hey guys, Antrim here, and welcome back to another Minecraft video, and today I'm going to be showing you guys the Matmos mod for Minecraft 1.1. And essentially what the Matmos mod is, is while well, it's a conjunction word for the words Minecraft and Atmosphere, so essentially what it does is it adds a sort of atmospheric sound effect to Minecraft, depending on what sort of situation you're in, whether or not it's day or night, and as you can see, nighttime is coming around, whether or not you're in a cave system or in the nether, and as well, uh, you can either download this mod with or without without weapon sound effects as well and uh, you guys are not hearing any of the sound effects right now because I currently have the mod turned off but if I go ahead with the mod installed hit the F7 key on my keyboard you can see on the bottom left it says Matmos loading and then in a couple of seconds here you're going to hear random sound effects okay there you go and actually the crit the cricket noise is one of my least favorite noises out of this entire thing so let me go ahead and let me switch this over to daytime here using too many items uh, there we go I'll bring it back to nighttime just to demo the sound effects in a little bit but uh, as you can see you can sort of hear like this random ambience all around me and uh, the next thing that I want to show you guys uh, as far as this mod goes is uh, you guys might be thinking maybe the sounds are a little bit too loud or maybe they're even too quiet for you maybe you just like playing with a lot of ambience so if you want to go ahead and you want to mess around with the sounds of this uh, there's actually a really intuitive way to do this if you hold down the F7 key, you can see that it brings up a little menu called Matmos Volume. And all you have to do is either look up to turn up the volume or look down to turn down the volume. It's actually insanely intuitive. So let me go ahead and let me throw this at like 40% or something. And the sounds are going to be drastically reduced while the other sounds of Minecraft are going to be the same. So definitely an awesome feature with this mod if you want to try it out for yourself. And I think it might still be a little bit too loud, so let me go ahead and let me turn it down to 20. 20, that'll work. And there you go. So the sounds are much quieter than they would be if they were at 100%. Now the great thing about this mod as well is that it is really expandable. Uh, for those of you who have ever played Deep Space Turtle Chase, and you guys remember the music scenes that occurred throughout the map, well those are all possible due to Matmos and some of the ex uh, expansions that you can actually do with this mod. Now I'm not going to go going into that in this video because I'm personally not aware of how exactly you do them, but I just wanted to inform you guys in this video that this is the mod that was used- Oh crap, there's a creeper there. Okay. So, yeah. It doesn't actually do any sort of, like, uh, background, epic background music when you get into battles or anything like that. It's not like a, a Final Fantasy sort of thing. But, uh, anyways, moving on here. Let me go ahead and, and let me turn the sounds back up a little bit. Let's go to roughly, like, 60% here. And, by the way, if you do happen to expand this with music, if you open up your inventory screen and then hold F7 there, you can actually change the volume of the music itself. So, it does allow for that sort of option to be there. And if you want to change the key that this is bound to, all you have to do is go into your controls in here, and then Matmos, you just go ahead and change that to whatever you want. Um, personally, F7 is fine for me, because I don't personally use F7 for anything else. So you guys have been hearing the sort of sounds that happen throughout the day. Now, I'm going to go ahead and flip it over to the midnight here, and then head over towards these mobs here, so you guys can get a better idea of... Oh man, if only that was a spider jockey. If only. Skeleton, can you please get on top of that spider? Please. Please. So yeah, you can hear the weapons that are going on here right now. And again, the uh, the whole weapons mod part of this mod is completely optional. You don't even have to install it. Uh, it's just sort of like a bonus feature that you can implement. And I personally don't like the weapon sounds, but I wanted to show them off in this video anyways, just for those of you who might like a more realistic sounding, you know, weapon swing. And as well, when you switch between your items as well, you get sort of a different sound effect. And if I go ahead... Okay, shoveling doesn't do anything different, but if I swing with my pickaxe, you get sort of a swing there. But you don't get that sort of noise when you actually go and mine something up. So, if your swing misses, you'll get that noise. If your swing hits, it won't. And then with your sword, it'll always just make that sound no matter what. And if I hit something, you can hear a slightly different sound with it. So, anyways, with it being midnight here, I'm going to go ahead and I am going to head off into the nether to give you... In my opinion, my favorite set of sound effects yet, because at the night the nighttime, they're okay, but the crickets are a bit obnoxious. The daytime is really good, and the nether is really good as well. So let's wait for the sounds to sort of wear off here. Listen to that sort of ambience. Doesn't that just sound like exactly what the nether should sound like? It's really sort of like open wasteland sort of thing going on, and I just completely destroyed my staircase by letting him do that. Crap. Okay, let's, let's get some cobblestone here. I know I have too many items to installed, so I could just as easily do that. Right, let's go ahead and let's head down here and see if we can fight. See if we can fight. Alright. Where are you at, buddy? Where are you at? 
See, isn't it weird just when I get silent, just sort of how much more tense the moment gets just because of additional sound effects? So, yeah, that's pretty much all this- that's pretty much all this mod has to offer, but again, like I said, I'm not able to show off absolutely every feature, and I may have forgotten a thing or two in this video, I'm pretty sure I ended up getting absolutely everything, though. But again, when you're in sort of, like, fighting situations and whatnot, like if I attack this guy here, you don't get any sort of, like, additional background music or anything like that, it's just- it's mainly based on where you are, not necessarily what you are doing. Alright, let's- let's hit this back to him. Let's see if I can kill him, let's see if I can kill him. Okay, I can do this. I can do this. What you got? What you got, homie? What you got? Oh, oh so close. Oh, ah, crap. I know I can kill you. I'm just gonna get closer. Let's go ahead and let's jog. Ah, no, you're not going low on me, buddy. Okay. Ah, get- Ah, oh, come on. Get owned, son. Ah, oh, I got- I got zombie pigmen coming after me, too, and they killed me. Ah, crap. <laughs> crap, I should have never attacked that zombie pigman, so I was not able to own that gassed up. But anyways, guys, that's pretty much everything I wanted to show off in this video. Again, with the customizations that are in place, and it allows you to turn the whole sound pack on and off just by hitting the F7 key and adjusting the volume by holding it, I really feel that this is a good addition to Minecraft as, uh, as a whole, and I really think that it's something you guys should check out for yourselves. Oh, and when you get set on fire, you get an additional sound effect as well. Or at least I thought, wait a minute, I just, tur I just turned it off. I should probably consider turning it back on. Okay, let's see if this works. Okay, there you go. So you kind of heard it there. You get different sound effects when you start free-falling as well. Oh, and when you go underwater, you get a different sound effect as well. So I should definitely show you guys that since there is water nearby. Uh, not, it's not deep enough in the moat, though. God, I hate how all of this is frozen over. This is just really annoying. Okay, let's break that. There you go. So you sort of get a different sound effect when you go underwater as well. It's really, it's all very subtle, but it does increase the sort of experience of Minecraft all the more. So anyways, guys, that's pretty much all I wanted to show you guys in this video. Uh, just co covering the mod and what it does. So I hope you all have enjoyed. My name is Ant Venom, and I bid you all farewell. Thanks so much for watching. I want to crunch, I want to punch that creeper in the face. Come here, creeper. Come here. I'm gonna punch you in the face and then rip off your face and wear it as my face and then I'm gonna own face with it. Or you're just gonna blow up. Come here, zombie!